friends welcome back to the channel it is of course Skylar Scribbles and in this video I'll be flipping through my November pages and showing you my December setup um, I have been using this Archer and all of a five notebook as a creative bullet journal um, I plan to use it into 2023 I've been experimenting it with it all year and I think I am ready to say that this more than likely will be in my lineup um, so this was my cover page. I didn't go back and change it because I was like, you know what? I don't need anything, you know. I just left it. Um, here's my task page and my focus page all filled out. I tried to do a tracker and I don't like it. I think that if I was going to do a tracker, it will have to be in the weekly format. So it might be better in my mini happy planner. So in this month, I wanted to take more rest. I did not rest as much as I would like. I had some personal stuff going on and I got drained by that. Um, and you know, crap happens, uh, but we move on. This by far is the cutest spread I've made in a long, long time. It is so pretty. Um, I use uh, colored pencils from Faber-Castell and polychromos yeah polychromos ones and I was able to make all the shades of all the girls it's very important to me that I you know just am able to vary my ladies because I like drawing them so much um, so yeah I love this page a lot of journaling and so like this is four days one day and then I did some journaling but I really like de decorating um, this is something that I like this notebook more than the Hobonichi notebook. I will say that the paper of the Ark and Olive is really thick, but the thickness is because it can withhold a lot more medium than the Hobonichi paper. I don't know because I use a lot of stickers, so I don't think I need something that's this thick, but it's pure white too, and I love that. I didn't finish her and it's okay. I'm trying to get used to being okay with the things that just don't work for me. Um, so this week I was trying to do something fun um, every day, like thankful grateful thought each week and I didn't like that that much um but I did like this girl and these quotes from the happy planner sticker books some more journaling I was planning to do a card and you know what I haven't even looked at the since but I'm glad I have it in here a roundup about my journals and planners I'm waiting on my hemlock and oak when I get the hemlock and oak I will give you the lineup video I'm not doing no lineup video without my hemlock and oak planner because that is like it. That's like my memory planner. And I need, I need it. I need to see it. I need it. I've never waited this long to do a lineup video. Um, and I'm, I'm slightly like, everyone else has their video up, but I don't have mine. Um, whatever. But this is my favorite spread with stickers, the purple. The purple. I love it. I love this purple. I love, I, eh, I just, I love this page so much. Um, again, Thursday is all over here, and Friday's here. Um, I changed my journaling. I don't need to journal about every single thing that comes across my head, um, but sometimes it's just nice. Um, I did receive a package from Audrey Okea, and I got more notebooks. Um, these are, uh, this is a traveler's notebook. Um, a traveler size notebook and this is an A5 one. They're comparable to the Archer and Olive. I haven't did like a pen test or any of the things but the paper feels similar um, and I might move into one of these next. I think it'll be cute to have one of these in the spring. Well actually you know what these mushrooms? Do mushrooms flower in the spring or the fall? I don't know but I might use this one next because I feel like the way that I journal, I would very easily fill this up very quickly. But very similar pages, similar everything. Um, one thing different is that she does have a nice little gold message about, you know, you are enough. And I think that's such a cute little touch. That's why I got them because the you are enough message was enough for me to buy it. Um, yes, so I, this is my other favorite spread that I liked. Um, this page is for the Black Panther movie. I am trying to, when I looked for pictures, I couldn't find a lot of screen shots and stuff about it. So hopefully now that it's been out for a little while, I'll go back to this and fill this in. And this is like just things on my mind. Um, this is trying to be positive with the outlook on life because I was feeling down. Whenever I feel down, I make a, a really, really 
to the next page. Oh yeah, and this washi tape is from the collaboration that pa wait, Paper and Milk did with Happy Daya one year. I can't remember. Um, because with that set, I also got um, some ornaments. And I'll show you my tree at the end of the video. Um, because the tree's up. The tree has been up since November 1st, but I didn't want to start anything on the internet. <laughs> uh, so I will share with your, my tree with you now. <laughs> um, here we go. This is when I started to think a lot, trying to relax myself. You know. Yeah. So these are not my favorite pages. But trying to sort of, that's what I try to do. I try to, you know, bad things happen good things are still here um and that's just one thing i think that journaling has just done well for me is that you know there are bad things that happen but you're still doing good um and for the next few pages i like pre-did these pages because i was going home and i didn't fill in sunday and i'm gonna leave it like that i really like the washi tape um from simply gilded like this grain i'm gonna use this up because this is just gorgeous um, it's from Simply Gilded. And here is my Pokemon journal. Oh my god, guys, like, I've always wanted to do a Pokemon journal so bad, but I've never been able to keep up with it. And I have paused playing the game for just a little bit. I'm going to try to get on that today. But look how cute it is. Look, look, she's my baby. And this is me in the game. I started off with red hair because, you know, your girl is styling. Um, she looks nothing like me. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I, I, but I love her. I love, I did the whole like chart so I can see where I am and I'm actually checking these off um, as I go because like there's three different paths so I made the spreads. Not all these Pokemon are new, um, but they're new to me. I haven't played Pokemon slash remembered all the Pokemon in a long time. I need to make another Pokemon spread because my favorite thing about Pokemon in this game is that you can see them and I'm trying to catch them all um, because I am the best Pokemon trainer ever. Um, not really. I'm really bad at strategizing so it's a cozy game to me. <laughs> and here's another beautiful page of illustrations. Like I don't know like what's going on but your girl is finding her groove with these illustrations we need to figure out how to draw shoes but you know other than that we good we good um some christmas planning and then some thanksgiving memory keeping and i really like this i really like this page i love having photos of my loved ones in here love this as well um this is my black friday list i got all of this no judgment we love stickers um so let me know in the comment section what you got um for black friday at coffin paper i got some clear mini happy planner covers that i extremely needed um because i love the clear cover on my mini happy planner here are some other things that i want to do and i am filming one of these which is awesome um and here is saturday um and i need to finish up sunday which is today and then we're going into monday and some other stuff now here is my setup for december i got these girls from Jalen paper co and sh they are just so beautiful um the foil is from sadie stickers and i absolutely love this this is a vibe i can like i have never been good at using like foil and like vertical kits but i think i can do it in journaling um and this is another spread i'm gonna do a pokemon spread soon and that's it so December, I'm going to say November was about this thick, right? So I believe we should be, I should be able to do December and January 1st in this notebook. And that's totally fine. Um, one thing I want to try to do is just keep on going. We don't need to start a new notebook for a new year. Um, and I don't even keep my goals in these books. I will do like monthly goals, but I don't keep my overarching goals in this book. I will keep that probably in 2023 in my Hemlock and Oak or my mini happy planner. But I'm so glad that you guys watched this video. Please subscribe um, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.